Welcome to Free Practice 2 of the F1 2019, uh, 2018 career mode. Excuse me. Alright. Only medium tires only has 11%, so let's just go out there and run. Run a lap or so. Trying a little, trying a new setup, see if this will help, help the car or make the car a little better. So I can compare the differences between FP1 and FP2. I'm gonna use this setup for the remainder of the weekend. And this is gonna be my last video until you hear from me in about a couple of weeks, so. Might need to put, might need to start thinking about getting some parts ready before final practice. Okay, let me check the front. All right. 13, 11, 14, 13. That's the wear percentage on my tires. Yeah, through that section, good. I'm just letting the car rotate through the corner. But I just get on track, see how the, see how the setup goes to my favor. Cause I know I'm gonna get asked, were you trying a different setup to, to get the car faster? Yeah. That was the plan I, w I was going to do for this session. Yeah. See, if I like this setup, I'm going to use this for every Spanish Grand Prix from now on. Alright, let's see. 26296, that's the first lap on this one. This is going to be my first full lap on a hot lap for ERS. Lost a little bit of time through one and two. Gain a shitload through that one. Good God. Of course, I didn't do a setup chain. I didn't do, I didn't run this setup. The setup I have in this car, I didn't use this for FP1. Just so everybody is clear. I ran just I ran a no setup in for in FP1, see if the time would go faster. If that's the case, great, hooray. If not, as I went a little slower through that right hander before I hit the DRS zone. If not, I'm gonna have to change it up. I'm gonna go back to normal with the 5100. Cause it made my car go a little faster than that. You know, then again, I'm just trying some setups. That's pretty much it. That's all I'm gonna do. All right. Also, uh, I had to fix my spotter because I'm not hearing my spotter on the earpiece, so I just put it on the on the uh, on the TV so you can hear it. Because I was here, I was not hearing my spotter for some reason. When I say spotter, I mean my race engineer. That would be more specific. I don't know why it's a spotter issue. Either it's a spotter issue or it's an earpiece issue. One of the two. I'm thinking about probably getting a new earpiece so that way I can hear my engineer better. Plus, you can hear me a little better. If I get some headphones, that would be good for... For, like commentary and shit like that. So, yay.
Okay, that's okay. First three, first three laps. The car's okay. The car's pretty good. Just, just trying to get the, trying to get the setup, trying to get a nice feel of the setup. Just getting some, uh, getting some setup feel is what I'm doing. Or just trying to feel the setup, see if it's okay. If it's okay, then I'll just leave it alone for Spain. If I accidentally use this setup for Monaco, oh god, can you imagine how sideways I'm gonna be? Shit. Hey look, Alonzo went to P2, but that's because he's on super softs. And I and I had e and I used a super soft for FP1. I used like what three compounds for FP1? Yeah, super soft. But then I had to give up. Um, I gave up the soft and the super soft. I kept the medium for some reason. But I know I'll give the medium back after the session's over. All right, let's see how the soft tires handle this setup. I'm gonna see what the super softs will do for free practice three. I need to make a wet setup. I need to make two separate setups for Spain. I need to make a wet setup and I need to make a, uh, this is my dry setup. I need to make a wet setup. So that way, um, I'm not using my dry setup in the rain because if I do, then you all know what's gonna happen after that. So just saying. Or just park the car for the end of the, end of the session. My God, I'm flying on these soft tires. Oh wow, almost a second faster than Fernando Alonso with this setup. That's because I'm running a setup. I'm not running, I'm not running the ones that's being used in the garage. I just created this setup just for Spain. Because Spain is really good. This setup I have for this track, really good. A 124 one. Wow, that's the quickest in the session. My race engineer is happy about that. Let's see if I can go a little faster on this setup. I thought Sableton why rules are not being enforced. Because once again, you're inconsistent about your freaking rules and all that other random shit. It's like you can't fix stupid. Trust me. Ooh, got down the 123s. I'm gonna go ahead and give the ERS a chance to rest. Or not rest, re uh, recharge if... God, there should be a difference between reset and recharge. You know what I mean, so. I'm just trying to, I'm just going to go on a long run, see how the car is going to handle on a long run with these tires. They handle okay, and then now I know what, a, what I'm doing for a long run pace. I think that's the goal for this session, just use the setup that I've created and go on a long run. Because when I end up having to do my uh, super, or yeah, my... Uh, tires for FP3 I'm gonna also do a long run I'll do a short run for like one of those tires and then do a long run before the rain comes because once the rain comes I'm pretty much D-O-N-E as far as the session is concerned so yeah of course 
course, the rain should be out of here no later than after qualifying, because if it's still raining, then I might get a free tire choice, and I might want to run the soft tires, because I love these tires. I think it's... I think I... I'll have to check my tire allocations, but I think I need to start the race... Either soft or super soft. Well, the super softs won't last long. Car got, car got squirrely. God, it was in the green just about a few seconds and then that happened. Had to get out of the throttle. back to the garage after putting up a nice little stint on for what I did that was pretty good so and WTF hang on a second my freaking Wi-Fi is just being a dumbass to the phone There we go.
Damn it, missed. Good God. Shit. God, I can't even keep it off the gravel. After this, we'll take our first commercial break.
Uh, whoops. So far, so good. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. I've kept, I've caught the other, I've caught one of the Haas cars. That's Roman Grosjean I've caught. Whoa, the back end of the car got a little squirrely after my, probably carried a little too much speed. I'm pressing it. A little too hard. Yeah, I'm pressing a little too hard. God damn it. Had stuff on my tires. Car repairs have set us back a little. Let's take a break. All right, we're back. Can't even see. Oh, I don't have a super soft until FP1. So I did use a super soft. I'm supposed to have a medium tire. Our best lap so far is a 123.3. Hmm. Need some parts. Watch, I still have this soft tire for cute for FP3. Then I'll finally get it. Supposed to run super soft in this in this practice. Unfortunately, I don't have a super soft until the rate until qualifying. Might run soft tires so I can save my super soft for the race. It's already in the purple with this setup. That's freaking crazy. 
Ah, shouldn't I corner cut that one? To the garage. I just killed the sign. <laughs> R.I.P. sign. Alright. <sighs> so, let's see how the do a qualifying pace with the soft tire then I'll do one for medium and then we'll call it an episode or session here so now we have it on max see if I can go a little faster on these tires hang on a second I gotta wet my glasses Glasses are a little dirty. All right. Now I can see. Oh, forgot to put that on. slower whoa whoa there we go well, I was going for it and unfortunately that's not gonna be a good lap that's not gonna be a good first lap I was trying a little too hard all right at least I'm gonna get another shot Check it off. Let's get better. Had a good lap going until I screwed up that one right hander just before you get to the chicane, and that really cost me a ton of time. Oh, yeah, I forgot to mention I'm going to run this uh, helmet design for the next race. Alright, let's see if I can get, let's see if I can not make that same mistake. Should have gone with a fresh set of super, fresh set of softs. I'm only down a tenth of a second. That's not bad. Okay. Ah, fuck! I fucked up! Oh, shit. That was really not a good lap.
All right. I went. I went a little slower. That was that didn't go according to plan. Oh well. We've had to spend time repairing the damage to the car. What if I did it with a medium tire? Let's see what that will do. Twenty six. So, had I not made that little mistake, I would have gone a little quicker than what I... I need to get some parts before Monaco. Oh, I got Hartley in front of me. Maybe I can use Hartley to get my kilometer speed up the straightaway. If these tires are faster or slower than the soft and super soft. Three tenths, three tenths of a second down. I'm gonna remember, I'm gonna have to give up my second set of soft. I've only given up two sets of soft tires and only a, only one set of super softs. I had to give it back to the manufacturer. I have to give my second set of soft tires up and my first set of mediums up because I'm going to save the mediums and softs for the race. Five, three. That's a lot slower. I think we're done. Actually, let's, no, I think we're done. Interesting practice session there then. Let's remind ourselves of the top three. Who are Blue, Verstappen, and Daniel Ricciardo. That's it for practice then. We'll see you again soon. Alright. See you guys for a free practice three.